Hi everyone, this is Natasha and I wanted to share with you the Your Paper Pantry April uh, ATC cards. This is group one and I think I have to give the Ingenuity Award to Jamie who made this adorable little three-dimensional quilled carrots from the garden and she even included a package of sweet mini carrots and I have to tell you my husband loves carrots. We have an entire raised bed full of carrots, so he'll be planting these little minis, I think, uh, in the next few days. So, really cool. I just kept this one in the bag so I wouldn't misplace the fact that this came with the carrots. And then the next one is from Samantha Davis. She has a pretty embossed uh, Life is Beautiful with a... Green. Let me just take that out so you're not getting a glare. I left the envelope because her label was on the envelope. So there's three different layers. Oh, and the color theme, color challenge was uh, various shades of green. And the theme was garden dreams. So there's the life is beautiful, is embossed. And a pretty green flower. So that's from Samantha. This one is from Sarah Saga, who participated in every single of the five groups. And she has grow stamped and embossed. And it's a really pretty double stamped tree with a little birdie. And the birdie is three-dimensional. Very pretty. And then this one is from Judy Moore. I love how she backed it on the black looks like chalkboard creativity blooms in the garden of life and she has a cute little charm made with love very pretty looks like she's even made the little roses and rosebuds butterfly and this is really really dimensional and distressed very pretty greens this one is from gail who participated in three of the Five groups and these are the tiny tiniest little metal flowers I've ever seen they look like they're six millimeters and look at all the shimmer in the card looks like it's a twall background paper very pretty and these look vaguely familiar I think I might have used them <laughs> not in this particular group but I think I might have used those kind of flowers so there's Gail's information uh, her YouTube is Gail, Gail Lefis, L-E-F-I-S, Lefis, I'm sorry if I'm massacring your name, and this one is mine, and you've seen it, um, I did include something else extra with each of the ones that were sent out, but not, um, mine. This one is from Jan, and Jan's a new participant, and... I have to say, she has the most wonderful layering effect, and I believe she hand drew each of the cards. So that's really, really cool. There's a lot of dimension on here. And look at the tiny, itty bitty little dragonfly charms. Really beautiful. Even the back is finished off. So cool. That's from Jan. These are from Lori Doyle. It looks like a little present for spring. The season of change. Love this texture. It's a lot of texture. It's almost like it's um, burlap, but it's not in a um, raffia and a pretty flower. Very shimmery. This one is from Aileen. And I love the itty bitty dimension, the itty bitty cor cor uh, corrugated board that she used. And the flowers are fabric. Really cool. She has a garden and um, vintage garden seed pack image in the back and garden dreams. And that's a little piece of burlap right there. Really cool. And look at that adorable little um, ladybug. Ling moved, but I moved it back. Really cool. And it's even stamped off on the back. 
And then last but not least for group one is from Sofia Castillo, who participated in, I believe, three of the groups, three or four of the groups, I can't remember. And beautiful poppy image stamped and colored and then glitter glued and a dimensional layered bloom on my favorite craft color background. Really nice. I think it's like I think it's lightweight chipboard or recycled chipboard. It's a really nice weight. So that's group one. I'm going to stop now and I will be back with group two. So if it's a separate video, um, I will link it below as a video response. So you don't have to go far. Thanks for watching.